It's really about that space that I get into where my mind is blank and I'm able to tap into something that feels like it is beyond myself and beyond my own body. When I look at the white, it's an invitation for me to discover and explore. And it really is a process of discovering. It really is a process of me finding where the next stroke is supposed to land. There's no way for me to actually know with certainty what I will be creating. And that's the addiction that I have to the creative process that draws me back every single time because I'm actually interested to find out what or where the brush will take me and what I will be communicating this time. And sometimes it doesn't even feel like I'm communicating it for myself. And that's really the beauty of what I do. I guess that's, that's why I know I can do this for the rest of my life because it never gets boring. I really don't think that I'm creating for myself. It feels like it feels like I'm in, like creating I'm creating for for all or that I become part of all everything, everyone. I feel really connected to nature and everything. It feels energetic and it, it's very humbling my creative process is very fluid I don't try to control anything I really just allow the strokes the brush to take me where it wants to I feel guided in the entire process. And there's something that shuts off in my mind when I'm creating. I trust that I know where it's gonna lead, that it's gonna lead to a beautiful place that I can't even imagine ahead of time. What feels most exciting about what I do is that I can create a world from white, from nothing. It makes you feel like anything is possible. I don't really pay so much attention to what goes on once I've already started the painting process. It's like I'm on that journey and I don't really think much about it. And the next time that I open my eyes and I really contemplate what just happened, what I just created, what went down, that's when I have usually completed the work. I want my work to be a bridge for people to understand themselves better and to actually take charge over the kinds of lives that they want to lead, the kinds of stories that they want to tell. So yeah, that's really what I hope that my artwork can prompt in people's lives. <laughs>